This is the Juice Network, yeah. our number one source for yeah. entertainment. I'm your boy, Tariq The Wave. Yeah. Again, we got another special, special guest. We are here at the Out The Mud Music Festival. Yeah. At the one and only King Carter. <laughs> what up, what up, what up, what up? I'm good. Hey, you good? I'm good. My yeah, play. So listen. So we are here at this event right here in, Solid, in Salisbury, North Carolina. Let me ask you, like, what does it mean to see all these independent artists coming out here displaying their talent, showcasing their music? Yeah, this is what it's about. Like, this, this is a beautiful thing. Seeing all these people, all this talent in one building, it's great. You know what I'm saying? So this, this is what we try to do. And, and, and the fact that this is still happening in the rain, when it's pouring down, raining outside, oh, yeah. and it's still motherfuckers outside uh, performing and inside performing, it's dope. That's dope. That's what's up. So, so let's let's talk about you for a second. How did you get started, like in the music business? I, I was a rapper. I started off as a rapper. Um, that was my first star in the game, and I, I just kind of learned the business, and I I just evolved. You know what I'm saying? Into yeah. into something else. Uh, started went into the management game. First artist that I was managing and went into the exact game, and the first artist that I was dealing with on that level was the baby, yep. and he turned out to, to be the biggest artist in the world, <laughs> and, and, and the rest is history. Okay, so would you, so being in North Carolina, right? Yeah. There's a lot of major, major artists popping out. Like for example, the baby is popping. Right. Son of Four Vegas. Yeah. Two C Two Times. Yeah. Lil John Bokeh. Yeah. And your son. Say the go. My boy. Uh, SCCU Eagle. You hey, know don't forget boy. Sunny Boy. Don't forget Tiani's Rose. Yes. Don't for, I'm, sh man, the list goes on. Don't forget Hot Boy Shaq. Don't forget Jay Hines. Money on the Motani T. Rich Don't Big Miley. Everybody, everybody, like, man, we can, we can Come on, man. We so, with all these artists, right? Right. What does it mean, like, for North Carolina to finally be on the map when it comes to being in the rap game? Hey, man, this all, this all I set out to do. This, this is like, this is like one of my life goals was to be able to say, North Carolina look like this. Yes. The Carolinas look like this. Yeah. Let's not forget Black Zach, the king of South Carolina. Absolutely. We got a project dropping on the 23rd. Yeah. 803 Legend. Don't let's not forget that. But nah, nah. This this was this was my goal. Like yeah. the, to, to be so, able to be part of that that movement that say, all right, this is what the Carolinas look like. This is this is this is one of the, the leaders in that movement and be able to be influential in that way. Yeah. So with with you be saying that, right? For right. any like artists, any artists that might hear this interview, any artists that's trying to get into the music game, right? What advice would you give them about how to get started? And how stay, to make and you got you got to stay consistent and you got to figure it out. The only uh, the only thing that you have to be able to do in this game, the only skill set that you need is the skill set of being able to figure it out. Like you got like you, you you can't you can't make excuses. You got to make sure that you know what the hell you doing. Well, not even know what the hell you doing. You got to make sure that you make you working effectively, Absolutely. consistently and effectively. Um, for you, right? What with everything that you're doing, you know, for the rap game, especially in North Carolina, what's next for you in the music game? What's next for you? Uh, social currency is next for me. You know what I'm saying? South Coast Music Group is next for me. You know, it, it, they're like just building it and making it a household name. Not a household name in the Carolinas, but a household name in the music industry. This year was the second year that me and Arnold made hip hop power players, and which is which is something big and never happened for niggas from the Carolinas. So we so we able to be on that level of exec and be able to be able to bring other people that had the same vision and share the same goals and, and put them on that same level. So next time you hear power players, you hear Sporty Odie, you hear Kia, you hear Rev, you hear J Hope, you hear Steve, you hear all you know what I'm saying like all these people that's involved with what we got going on like that's that's a that, that's the goal ladies and gentlemen this is the juice network king card yeah it's your boy treat the way we are here at the ski mud 704 Salisbury, north carolina we are out yeah.